Okay guys, we're up to the next step. We're going to create the T of the piece. So use a similar process to what we did with cutting the holes for our pipe just before. So what we can do here is create a plane. Offset from plane again. We can select one of those two planes. Either one of these will be fine. We'll go XZ again. Now we just have to determine this offset. Now I'm just going to go back to my previous piece and have a look. Now side on view here, the distance that we need to extrude this from this point to the center of our existing part is 30 millimeters. So that's going to be the distance that we offset this plane in our new part. So coming back to here, 30 millimeters, and then hit OK. That way we've now got a plane to work off. All right, next step coming up, create 2D sketch. We're going to select this plane here. All right. Now, trick is we want to find the center of our piece. Now, if you remember correctly, I think it was 64 millimeters. So we're just going to sketch that here, and that should be 24 because that was the outside diameter. So if we zoom in here. You can see that line hitting the edge just there quite nicely. Now all we need to do is dimension the center of this circle to the end of the pipe. So half of 64, ooh, that's pretty close, is 32. Now if you really want to double check that, and I suggest you do, you can just go from one end to the other and just double check. Now I can just hit escape because I know that's there. Alrighty, finish the sketch. Now we've got that funny looking plane in the middle of nowhere. All we want to do here is extrude again. Now you'll see, once I zoom this properly, it's going the wrong way. What we can do here is see these little arrows where my cursor is. We can change the direction in which they go because we still want to add material, not cut away. So we want to go direction 2 and that'll go down. Now what we want to happen here is we want this to be exactly the distance that we did before so that it's halfway. So what we need to do here is change that to 30 and you'll see that the preview will look something like that and that's what we want at this stage. Hit OK and we're done. Next step coming up.